15 ounces, 11 pounds, 14 ounces, 12 pounds, and 13 ounces, 14 pounds, 3 ounces. It's underway, the FLW College Fishing National Championship on Lake Kiwi in Seneca, South Carolina, featuring the most talented young anglers in the country. From first to tenth, I think it was less than three pounds. So the cut is three pounds away, but it feels like it's right there behind us. You know, there's a giant target on our backs being a lead and something like this. And it, it, there's no breathing room. There's no room for air right now. And it's a little bit different from what we're used to down in Texas, especially being able to see 10, 12 foot down and see the bottom. It's uh, kind of frustrating when you can see that there's no fish there. But then again, when you cast up on the bank and all of a sudden there's just fish comes out of nothing, it's, it's really impressive. And it's, it's really cool, honestly. But uh, definitely got to put our head down and grind. You can't win it on day one and two, but you can always lose it. It's something you hear from pros. You hear that all the time in fishing. So. We definitely don't want to go lose it today. We want to keep ourselves in contention. Definitely not the size you want to have in the box. But, yep, she's almost 14 inches. Fish number one right there. Sir, before we came to Kiwi, we really did a lot of reading about the, what was going on in South Carolina with the weather, you know, how the lake had been fishing with previous local tournaments. And so we learned that the spawn was going to be almost a full force, you know, a lot of fish moving up shallow, a lot of big largemouth. And so we really tried to key in on those fish that were up shallow, you know, and we found some good ones in practice, which really benefited us yesterday. Fish? Good one? Ah, better. No, about the same size. Hey, yesterday we had a, a little school of spots that were moved up between these two docks. And this little rock bank right here. Mm -hmm. A little bit better. How to work? There's two. Fish number two on the day. Dallas Baptist maintaining their lead as they look to be one of the top 10 teams who will fish on the third and final day. Lake Kiwi is a small lake that sits just north of the much larger Lake Hartwell. It really isn't as well known and that makes it more of a challenge for our tournament anglers. The spotted bass here are usually dominant, but with the warmer weather and clear water, it's hard not to spend some time looking for large mouse on beds. Dallas Baptist University, four pounds and 11 ounces.